And we are back live here for our main event. And here comes Sheldon, the former WCW US champion. Oh boy. This is going to be a big one tonight for our main event. A preview of what is to come this Friday. The following contest is our main event scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from another world. Weighing in at 176 pounds. Sheldon! Sheldon making his way to the ring. Had that huge war with Astro Boy. But thank God that war has come to an end. And Sheldon ought to let go of, Ch of Jenny Wakeman now because Jenny Wakeman has already have a new, has already found herself a, a real person, I mean a real robot she can hang out with. I mean like a real person to hang out with to be precise, but Astro Boy is a real good young man who loves to show a lot of good girls a good time last I checked, but enough about that. But right now though folks, this is a preview of the eight-man tag team elimination match of what is to come this Friday at TNW Invasion. And, whoa, wait a minute. I'm being told from the floor that this Friday, for this eight-man tag team elimination match, there's going to be no count-outs and no disqualifications. So look, anything goes this Friday. And we know this name. Here comes Yami. Here comes the Pharaoh. And Sheldon better be afraid because he's never faced off a man like this. Because Yami is the is the Pharaoh. He's been on a roll here in ACW. He, he lost a couple of matches, only won a few matches so far. He's also the student of Shadow Fiend and his longtime friend, My Valentine. No doubt about that, but. And there's the Pharaoh. Oh boy. This is going to be big, I'll tell ya. Oh boy. And his, and his opponent from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 225 pounds. Yami! Yami the Pharaoh making his way to the ring as the Pharaoh, the king of Egypt, knows how to make an entrance. And he's fans here in the ACW arena. Already know that what's going to happen this Friday. Knowing the Pharaoh is going to give it his all. With what of what is to come this Friday? Knowing that Yami, however, along with Yugi Moto, two of the best friends that have ever been, been at duelist duelist tournaments together ever since. And however, I just found out from my headsets that that Jaden was not only trained by Yugi Moto personally but also Yami the Pharaoh himself. As the Pharaoh makes a grand entrance like he knows how. And whoa, look at that. And how intimidating is that? As Sheldon looks on on the outside, as that is intimidating, to say the least. When you look into the eyes of, of the Pharaoh, you know, you know that your fate is about to be sealed within the hands of that man tonight. Look at this. This is going to be an all-out war in this one-on-one -on -one matchup here. And we already know that Taya won her match in the dominating fashion, if I may add. But they both went at it, both Brandy and Taya. But earlier, Taya got attacked from behind by AEW members Riho and Nyla Rose. But that was until afterwards she was saved by Stephanie McMahon with a sledgehammer. And, of course, saved by Sakura. But Stephanie McMahon took out both Brandy. And she took out both Nyla Rose and Riho with that sledgehammer. And AEW got out of Dodge. AEW and WCW had done, had, had done a, number, a, a lot of our guys here. No doubt about that. That was an all-out war here. Yami with that takedown. Dominating the fight. Going for an early pin attempt. And wait a minute. Sheldon kicking out before the ref even made a count. Spinning heel kick by the Pharaoh. What a move by Yami. And now the Pharaoh with the Michinuku driver. But can he seal the deal? Kick to the spine. And, uh oh. It made Sheldon mad with a swinging European uppercut. Catching the Pharaoh right in the jaw. 
And a stop of the spine just mocking Yami. Not a good idea on Sheldon's part here. And a right hand to the face. A vicious right hand, but Yami is still standing. This time saw that one coming. And right hands. Another right hand. As Yami is just taking it straight to Sheldon here any way that he can to win this matchup. And there's a takedown by Yami. Here's the cover. Is this it? One, two, and a kick out at one. Oh, look at this. Yami's got the legs locked in on the head of Sheldon. And Sheldon escaped that one and saw that one coming. And this time Sheldon with Yami has got him up. Looking for a vertical suplex. And what a show of power by this young man. I just wish he were with TNW and the HWF or right here in ACW. Because right now though, this young man is nothing but a total lack of disrespect to Jenny Wakeman. Another vicious right hand to Yami. The Pharaoh getting dominated here by Sheldon now. Yami dominates Sheldon nearly go into this match. As Sheldon continues the battle back here against Yami. The Pharaoh getting dominated at the hands of the former WCW US Champion Sheldon. Sheldon now has him up. Power bomb. But Yami's back up. And Yami with the Falcon Arrow suplex. And down goes Sheldon. And the fans here are showing their love to Yami. Kick to the face there by Sheldon. Into a flat over DDT. Taking something out of Jake the Snake Roberts playbook. And oh, wait a minute. Again, he was, he's going for it like he did to Astro. That swing and neck breaker. Cover here. One. No. And the Pharaoh kicks out. Sheldon cannot believe it. He thought he had the Pharaoh beat there after that. What's Sheldon going to do here? Oh, no. Just like he did to Astro a couple of weeks back at Las Vegas in your four. That big boot off the corner. And now trying to stop away there on Yami. He's not even going for the cover. He's just punishing the Pharaoh any way that he can to put the final touching on the cake. And these fans here are showing you why they hate it. These, these ACW fans are showing their support for Yami tonight. There's that takedown, that headlock takedown from, from Sheldon. And now Yami getting dominated in the early goings. Oh, wait a minute. Sheldon bringing him back up. Axe handle, but Yami saw that one coming. This time he caught him into a schoolboy. Super kick. Shades of... Shades of Mac attack, TNW Hall of Famer. Cover here. One, two, no! Oh, wait a minute. Sheldon now mocking The Undertaker. Not a good idea, Sheldon. Yami right now in the corner. And a right hand from Yami. Returning the favor with a flat over DDT of his own. And the fans here are loving it. They love it. Listen to this response for Yami. The fans getting behind the barrel tonight. This is our epic main event of the evening here, folks. This is an all-out woo we are seeing. This is an all-out assault. Wait a minute, wait a minute, Yami. Over something big here. Shade of Seth Rollins with a buckle bomb. Buckle bomb off the corner. And wait a minute. That's the Usos music. Wait a minute. I'm being told for the fourth AEW and WCW on our production truck. And Yami's had enough. And a counter by Sheldon. Popping Yami right in the jaw. And a right hand in the face. Yami saw that one coming. And a suplex by the Pharaoh. A stop there, nobody home. But he caught him. Whoa! What a move by the Pharaoh! And down goes Sheldon! 
kick to the gut. Here it comes. The big stop. What a move by Yami. Come on, bro. Make the count. One, two, three. And Yami picks up the win. If that happens to Sheldon, eight, ACW, TNW, HWF may have a three, a four on three advantage. And that took its toll on Sheldon. That's 99. And there's that swinging neck breaker, just mocking, just disrespecting Jenny Wakeman again. As you saw right there. And there's the cover, the hook of the leg. Sheldon thought he had it there, but Yami kicked out at one. And then there's the schoolboy into the super kick. Shades of, of Mech Attack, TNW Hall of Famer. Here is your winner, Yami! What a win for the Pharaoh! And how intimidating is that? Yes, my God, I cannot wait for this Friday when Yami teams up with his teacher, Shadow Bean, Astro, his teacher, Shadow Bean, and the Big Mayhem's own Astro Boy as they team up with Sasuke in an all-out war for the ages against Team AEW and WCW's own Chris Jericho, Sheldon, and of course, Eric Rowan and Daniel Bryan. And I got a feeling it's going to be a bad night for AEW and WCW this Friday. Can they get it done this Friday? Can it be a great night for, e for TNW, ACW, and HWF? We'll find out for sure this Friday. And we are out of time here in the ACW Arena. On behalf of everyone here in Phoenix, Arizona, I've been your commentator, MJ. We'll see you at the at, at the Rockford Metro Center where ACW teams up with TNW and HWF against AEW and WCW this Friday. Good fight. Good night. And thanks for joining us. And my God, what a night. My God, what a night. What a night. When a man's heart is full of deceit, when WCW and AEW dies when the light sky falls over the top in heaven. From the ashes of a once great man has risen the curse. A rod that must be unrelated. He looked the skies for a vindicator. Someone to strike fear to, to protecting to TNW, HWF, and ACW. The battle between good and evil has begun against an army of the light was a wrestling warrior, the prevailer of good, with the voice of silence and the mission of justice. This is GGP.